And everybody goes, who's Dugard? How come you never have him on? Number one, he's boring. And number two, look at those glasses. My God, look at those glasses. I'll take those him off. A- those aviators. Um, <laughs> anyway, he's got a paperback out. Just him, not me. I wasn't involved with it. It's called The Epic Battle of, for the City of Lights Taking Paris. And uh, this is a trilogy. Uh, next one coming up soon, Taking Berlin. Uh, and Dugard writes these without me because I'm too annoying. Uh, and he's <laughs> got to get away from me. Uh, so we'll talk about both of those now. So Dugard, you're, uh, it's a big time. Here you are. Everybody's asked me, where's Dugard? Okay, here you are. So uh, Killing the Legends, you know what my big challenge is here is to try to convince people it's a history book. I mean, they think that all of a sudden you and I are working for People magazine. And uh, I go, gee, these are three icons that we tell you about influenced American history the way we live now. What are people saying to you about it? Uh they're surprised we're venturing into pop culture. Um, and I, I tell people it's about time. I think I've, I mentioned Michael Jackson or Diana to you about seven years ago. And you said, no, 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 we're not going to do pop culture. But if we're going to do it, we're going to do it right. And that's what this is about. It's three great tragic legends. It's, uh, you know, in the research, you know, from a historical point of view, is just the same deep dive we do with all of our books is just completely focused on getting all the facts straight, telling the story. Uh, in revealing history in a way that people have never read it before. 